Hi everyone, I'm Sandra Bennett and this is the Weekly Unbox. Okay, I have never done this before, but I am super, super excited. I got stocking stuffers, which is not only my favorite kind of gift, it's my favorite kind of gift to buy for my kids. I'm a big fan of the stocking stuffers, so I feel like I really scored. I wasn't sure which one I was gonna open first, but I'm gonna go old school, because I know when I was a kid, I thought if it was bigger, it was better. So I'm gonna, although as an adult, that's not really the case, right? Because you think of all the cool, like expensive things that come in small boxes, but I'm gonna go back old school and start smallest to biggest. Let's see what's in this one. I don't want to mess up the paper, it's pretty. Oh, wait, hang on. All right, it's wrapped nicely. Has some weight to it. Let's see, it feels like, is this a beauty product? Oh, please say it's a beauty product. <gasps> oh, this is not small. This is big and fabulous. Wait, how many are there? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I just scored six philosophy, high shine, high gloss, high flavor lip glosses. I can tell you that because I wear them. I know exactly how these go on. I got peppermint stick. Okay, coconut frosting I already have at home. That's a really good one. Uh, what's this one? Oh, daiquiri. I'm down with that. Mixed berry tart. Raspberry sorbet. Okay, vanilla birthday cake, like how could you ever be in a bad mood if you have vanilla birthday cake on your mouth? So this was a good one. Okay, so that was the smallest box, but I have to say if they're all like this, I'm gonna be pretty pleased. Okay, so I'm gonna put these right here. Actually, I'm gonna move them over. I'll be distracted by all that high gloss and high shine. So those are philosophy. What's the next, I'll do this one next. I have these little notes, but I don't need it for that one because I know exactly what that's about. But I don't know what's in the box. The notes were just in case I opened it up and had no idea what it was. Okay, another one that's nicely wrapped. Okay, these small ones are turning out good, look. Oh, two. Okay, this is maybe the world's most perfect stocking stuffer. And let me tell you why. These are by Lotus, and I know because I've seen these before, I think they have RFID protection, um, but basically this is your wallet that will fit into your clutch. It will fit into just that little pocket of your tote. Um, they're great because for a lot of people, these will just fit in a coat pocket and they have, I don't know if I've actually seen these ones before, but let's take a look at it together. Looks like they have a pocket here, which would be great for like, um, I don't know, like your parking ticket and that kind of thing. And then more for cash and then your credit card slots. Wow, that's nice. And what's nice about this is if you're giving a QVC gift card, there's lots of spaces or like your coffee card and there's two. So now one for each bag. Okay, that's good. That's really good. All right, so that's by Lotus. Let's see, was I right about that? Oh yes, two slim cases with six card slots and RFID protected. Do I know my Lotus cases or do I know my Lotus cases? Okay, so now this one's a toss up because they're both kind of the same size. I'm gonna save the tallest one for last. All right, let's see. I don't know who boxed these, but I swear they're in living in my head. It's Privé Reveaux. This is my absolute favorite sunglasses. Oh, please look at me, sun yes. I don't, I've never worn these before, but good, right? Here's what's amazing about these sunglasses. I have, I think maybe, I think I have six pairs of the readers and three pairs of their sunglasses already, but somebody knows me because I don't have this style. The clarity is fantastic. They look really good and they're super affordable. Like I don't think I've ever paid more than $30 for a pair of Privé Bravos. Plus they're like, Jamie Foxx wears them. He started the company. So this is how you look like a celeb without paying the celeb prices. Those are cute. But which one is this? I want these. Oh, the Hepburn Cat Eye Polarized Sunglasses. All right, oh wait, hang on. I wanna show you the coolest thing about Privé Bravo cases. So, you know, it's the case and then you end up never taking your case because it's bulky and you don't know where to put it. But with Purvey Reveau, when they're not in the case, watch this, they fold down. Wait, wait, there's a card in there, hang on. They fold down, so now my case, and then I got my Lotus, and then I got my lipstick. I'm still traveling with a clutch, y'all. Like, look at that, it's all small. Man, who seriously did this? Who, did you do this? Who picked these gifts for me? All the stuff I like actually either buy or want. Okay, there's one more. 
The first three were really good, so now I'm like a little nervous. What if this is the dud? Let's see. <laughs> I'm not an actress. I won't be able to fake it. Oh, I don't know what this is. It's a rabbit. I don't know what these are. What is this? Oh, wait, they some kind of wine toppers, I think? Wait, hang on. Hang on, you're probably watching this at home and you know exactly what they are and you're really frustrated and screaming because I don't know what they are. Oh, it's a set of four wine and champagne sealers. Oh, you know what, this is smart because my husband doesn't drink wine and I almost never do, but then every once in a while I'm in the mood for a glass of wine and I don't open it because I know I'm gonna end up throwing it away because I don't drink a whole glass of bottle of wine at the time. This is smart, I should actually, I should own these. So let's recap. I now can drink all the wine I want. I can drink to my heart's content because I now have a way to close up the bottles. I won't feel guilty throwing wine away. And when I'm done, I got my lip gloss. And then, you know, when the wine has passed, because I'm not leaving the house after I've had wine, I have my Lotus and my cool sunglasses. I think that's a pretty successful unboxing. I'm like kind of giddy just thinking about it all. So that's my stocking stuff for unboxing. I didn't know what to expect. I think they nailed it. And um, if you want to see more, you can go shop our holiday gift guide. Have a good one.